I want to say thank you to all my subscribers. Fuck yeah. What are they like? 118, 119 of you now? That's cool. Um, spread the word. To all of your friends, your neighbors, your neighbors' friends, your moms and thems. Fuck it. Tell everybody. So, what kind of videos would you like to see me do in the, in the near future? Because I'm a... I'm up for, for doing anything. I, I know uh, Smash mentioned videos on... Peyote... The Soul and uh, Ritual Magic, and I think I, I discussed a little bit of Ritual Magic when I was talking about Greater Magic, um, and there's, there, there are tons to be said um, about it. I don't believe in the existence of, of an eternal soul, uh, just to get that out there, and I also um, find it highly unlikely that we actually leave our bodies during an astral projection or out-of-body experience session. Um, although there is something to be said about the transmittative qualities of human brain waves and our uh, electromagnetic fields. Um, other things. Um, Someone on my uh, Lucid Dreams uh, projection out of body experience video uh, said that they get stuck in that, that vibratory state. And here's where the, that practicing of reaching out. Um, if you take the logical jump to start doing that with your body, and when you're meditating, uh, practice uh, getting up and moving around while just sitting there, but keeping that. Um, keeping that information stored inside of your mind so that your, your mental projection of yourself, your, your body image, um, you can manipulate that and its, its, its feeling, um, which is what you're using in, in, in dream. So, um, using that to move and maneuver um, throughout whatever realms you decide to create. And so when you get those vibrations, um, roll over or stand up. Uh, that, that, that's a uh, that's, that's, that's my tip to you.